So it turns out that log of z to the n is not equal to n times log z in that the set of possible values of this does not equal the set of possible values of this. Um, this is just easy, this is easy to show with a counterexample. So suppose z equals i and n equals 2. So let's look at what the left hand side gives. So we've got log of i squared, which is log of minus 1 which is log of e to the i pi plus 2p pi. Which is just i times 2p plus 1 pi, where p is any integer. Now, what happens with this one? So we've got 2 log z, so it's like 2 log i. So log, log i is log of e to the i pi by 4 plus 2 q pi, sorry, pi by 2. Um, and that gives us 2 times i times 2q plus a half pi, which is i times 4q plus 1 pi where q is any integer. So clearly, what possible values of i pi are we going to get here? Well, when p is 0, we get 1. When p is 1, we'll get 3 and so on, 1, 3, 5 and so on. Here, we miss some out, because when q is 0, we get 1. q is 1, we get 5. So we get 1, 5, 9 and so on. So these two sets of values are not the same.